and welcome back. We're playing, uh... Chicken Police! Demon are heavier than broken hearts. Big sleep. It's a big sleep. I ran out to get a pack of cigarettes. And you That's something, all right. Why does that road look real? That's one real ass looking road. The legendary chicken police. The legendary chicken police. But buying a pack of smokes is more than I can handle right now. <laughs> Not me. It's very easy. Not lay low, dude. Clawville. You know, you know, I didn't. What was the movie? Fuck. Clawville. Z Zootopia. Oh, Zootopia. <laughs> I think Zootopia's got some unintentional popularity here. <laughs> a crocodile lighting a dove? Not in my town! Not in my town! <laughs> Not in my neighborhood! Oh. Oh, oh. Oh, it's a moon presence. Uh, what is it, James Mom? Chicken, Chicken police. police. Paint it red. That's an odd looking real ass city almost. I feel like I'm watching Sin City, but just. It's like, you remember Animal House, that book we had to read in school? About yeah. The fucking Communist Party or whatever? Oh, uh, yeah. This is what it kind of feels like, to be honest with you. Ah, uh, yeah. <laughs> chicken and hounds. How does a chicken drive? <laughs> well, he has a real body, a real human body, and a chicken head. Does it make sense? I don't know, man. The dog eats chicken. That's our nature. Uh, it's 121 days from retirement. <laughs> Must be nice. We are young. We have many years to go before we can retire. Exactly. Don't ever don't, say don't that. Don't ever say that. Everything could go wrong. Rourke District, former Atlas Hotel. That is scary. <laughs> what the fuck? What the hell? <laughs> I don't know. Oh, crap. My office lock is a piece of shit if a dame can pick it. She stood in the darkness. The light painted stripes on her body. It whispered okay, that secret voice. little things that were never there in the first place. But she was no zebra. <laughs> Reality was just a light switch away. Elizabeth or Charlotte? I was sure she'd have a sophisticated sounding name. She had a bygone look in her eyes. Oh. I'm scared. <laughs> I don't want to be here, man. This is weird. We used to be stars. There's a lady with a deer head in my room. Tabloid press, radio interviews, and even a book series. I don't miss those days. Of course, Marty, my old partner, would disagree. Marty? <laughs> Marty? This is painful memory. Uh, memories of my old life before my left me took our daughter. Old... That's a. F That's a. <laughs> That's a pigeon bitch with a guitar. <gasps> Good times. What the Good fuck is his name? Good, Good things in life don't, la don't last long. The best, ones, the best ones always leave first. I saw, I saw that in the window, window of a shoe store. store. I never I understood it. Understood but what it had to do with shoes? M.B. Davis. M.B. Davis, the eternal king, king of jazz. jazz. The photos, the photos from, from the days of jazz, jazz prohibition. I only heard the old man live one time. The old man but I'll never forget that time. night. And not only I'll because I woke up at the harbor night. without my gun, and not my badge, only because I woke my up pants. at the harbor without my gun. God damn. <laughs> the wild this is gonna be a game where I'm gonna be forced to do my damn technical You don't have to. I understand. Hey, it's gonna be a thing I have already committed. My heroes when I was the wild old gentleman. Old These guys rebuilt the city after the Great Fire of 1867. My heroes when I was a little chick. I'm starting to think they should have let clock. I hate nothing. It's fine. Let's continue. Maybe in another life. What are we doing? In another story. Oh, oh, that's voiced. Oh. <laughs> well, we don't know because we, we don't can't know. hear. I don't know what I don't know. I'm gonna leave this up here for right now. This I can actually tell something is voiced or not. Stuff, stuff on shit. Okay. Apparently, all that was voiced. Huh. I promised myself Sorry. I'd write a novel one day. I wanted to travel the world when I was a kid, but I think I'm gonna end up dead in here, whether I. You like gotta be or that not. negative about it. I know, right? It's kind of negative. Holy shit! Should we talk to the dear lady? 
My Pick up the gun. Pick cigarette. up the gun. My last cigarettes. <laughs> You're lucky I don't have a light, pal. She doesn't seem so okay. dangerous that I need to grab my gun, but you never, <laughs> you know. never know. Never know. Need to put one between a deer's my eyes. And my badge. The wallet is real. The badge. Ain't. Blood boil. Chief Blood Boil hmm. took mine, so I got this one out of a pack of cornflakes, just in case. Well. I'm looking around for everything and not I don't even know where even the key is. Whatever's inside is gonna stay there forever. Huh. Some detective, huh? I can't even find her keys. <laughs> Dial nine guan guan. There you go. Send help. Please. Oh, nobody answered. Hang up. It's ringing. Ah, okay. Alright, then. Every whiskey, Cheap whiskey. Has the same color nowadays. At least in this price range. Interesting. I don't even know what these papers are. <laughs> oh, okay. Alright, okay, we'll talk to the dear lady. Let me introduce myself. My name is Deborah. Miss Deborah Arbanel. Oh, this is uncomfortable. <laughs> I hate that they have human bodies. I know. And just animal head. Why? I don't know. You're mistaken, ma'am. Oh, really? Please enlighten me, Mr. Featherland. <laughs> of course. <laughs> of course. I'm not a private eye. I'd recommend Philip. M uh, I mean, Mr. Philmar Lowe instead of me. He's a nice guy. I love how the mouths are moving as well. Believe me, Mr. I'm just confused Heather. by everything. What the accident. fuck you got me playing, dude? <laughs> I don't know. This was a free game of my home bundle, so I don't know. Dude. After all this shit, police, we play together. You thought leave. chicken police I accept private was a good idea. <laughs> yes. To. Not even from a classy dame like you. Am I that easy to read? Yes, you're a deer. But tell me, since you've invited yourself in, would you? I don't. I don't usually. Well, I've got liar. A one, I bet you're the killer. To drink alone. <laughs> that oh, here I go again. <laughs> Just like the good old days. You don't drink, but you say bourbon. Lie right there. Ran it. Cover. That's all I have. Cover. We don't need to. We don't need to look at the case. Cover. I got a new codex entry. So come you base. On. You barely Spill drink, it. but you want to drink the bourbon. Beginning. <laughs> Sit. I don't like where this is going. <laughs> I don't if I see that dress fall off, it's gonna be literally cocking. Oh. Books I'm never gonna read. Books I'm never Maybe gonna read. Nobody ever has. Maybe nobody ever has. Fuck off. Behind that door uh, lies the kingdom of dirty clothes, cigarette butts, and empty bottles. Maybe look at your codex. Okay. The notebook! The notebook gives the I hate that the movie. <laughs> Here you gather vital information about the case, the suspect, or victims, and the locations you will visit. How does it work? Click on the dark text of a picture in your notebook to read the translated version in your language. How else would I read that description in my language? I've already read it in my language. Name, Deborah Einstein. Deborah Ibis. <laughs> She's an Impala, a Sepsiris Melchius. Shut up. She's a female. <laughs> Special feature. She's pretty fragile. Nothing's too special. How's that a special feature then? It's more like a. More she like runs a... errands uh, for her employer. A sophisticated lady, but I don't think she's from a particularly wealthy or influential family. I would certainly hope not. Look at your codex. Alright. Uh, oh! Oh! <laughs> her green one detected. I know we here. This is all you, buddy. <laughs> Chicken police. You're here. The Claw of Clawville. She was a famous duo, Santano, Sonny, Featherland, and Marty McChicken gained fame for a game. This game is making me hungry, dude. <laughs> to play New Year's Eve. They flew high for almost 10 years. But a 
Faithful, Faithful Brawl Ball. put an end to the legend. This is a series of novels about them by Meredith H. Marvel. They have published ten books over the course of seven years before the series faded out of public interest, as did the Chicken Police itself. I guess you could say they were fried. <laughs> the wild ones. Three gods are revered in most places across the wilderness. They're great wild ones who make up the holy trinity of creation, destruction, and silence. But wouldn't technically two of those be the same thing? Anyway. Harati is the goddess of okay. creation. But. Patapati. Patapati. Patapati is the lure of destruction. And Nagavita is the genderless ghost of silence. And look at this. Keep the balance between creation, destruction, and their never ending conflict. Okay. City of the Claw. Clawville has been an independent state for more than 900 years. During the state's foundation, four nations joined forces represented by four animal fingers and their four hands as the Crest Clawville. In reality, the tribal alliance of the reptiles and the great insect clans are also played an essential part of the city's founding, but they never got to be represented by the Crest. Mm mm. This gave birth to a political. To a political and cultural antagonism between the species, Clawville preserved its political autonomy. And the dream that it is only the city state in the wilderness where predator and prey of any race can live in peace, hence the name the City of a Thousand Colors. They call me Crawl Daddy. <laughs> Alright. Okay, uh. Do you have any idea what you're supposed to be doing? That's bad. Yeah. Oh, oh, we got to go correctly. Your mistress is receiving threats. Your what mistress is receiving threats. Exactly. It's mm. a very strange matter. First, there were letters. Mm -hmm. Then it came printed on a wine bottle's label. Sent mm -hmm. Yeah, did I not call the regular police? Brick, I'm pretty sure those pigs will be there. And finally, they painted it on the wall of the house in giant red letters. I don't regret what I said. <laughs> don't, don't ever look at me like that again. Dig a little deeper. If you don't mind, I'd like to ask you some. Please. Oh boy. That's why I'm here. Stop saying it like that, Jesus. Please. I think that my lady is a target of some strange threats. All of them are written. <laughs> I hope they're written. Okay. I hope they're written. Oh, that's my. Uh, pull the gun on her. <laughs> I haven't dusted you off in a while, partner. Looks like I may be needing you. <laughs> I may be now. needing you now. Suits her in the fucking knee. <laughs> Question Who is this dame anyway? And what the cluck is, she, the doing cluck is she doing in my on apartment New on New Year's Eve? Eve? Okay. Yeah. Question? Question? Focus, like focus on what you know about the suspect. Is he or she suspicious? Concentrate on that. Let's see. Suspect. John Doe. Focus. This fellow's rather suspicious. I need to concentrate on that. Focus. Suspicious. Impressions. Suspicious. Detective meter. Up and down. <laughs> he is suspicious. I am suspicious. Why are you suspicious? A new impression. Question. Want to g gather every impression from the suspect. Every impression has a new question line. A new impression. Question. So many options. Detective Beater is your best friend. It shows how well the question is going to keep it on the positive side, okay? Blah, blah, blah. I like that. Plus 100. I must be cautious and smart. She's shy, which I can use to my advantage, but I must be careful what I say to her. I can use to my advantage. Is it voice? But I must mm -hmm. be okay. Careful about what I'll, say I'll let you know if it's not. Or I can scare her off. Let's start gently. And when the time comes. Oh, God, your face is so tiny. Which are you, ma'am? Wait, wait. Where exactly are you, uh -huh. ma'am? I'm, I'm not somebody important, Mr. Featherland. Oh my god, it's so, it, it's so <laughs> weird. It's so unsettling. It, this whole game is unsettling. I feel like I'm playing a horror game. I carry out the wishes of my employer, nothing more. This mm -hmm. is a simple paperwork. Mm -hmm. Most you have awful pretty jewelry to be a simple, uh, secretary. Me, can you even swim? Mm. Believe me. This is just as unpleasant for me as it is for you, if not even more. Okay. Huh? Subject Deborah. This car spreads dancing shy. Mm hmm. Okay. Impression shy and doubtful. Okay, it's going well. We're in the positive, Brandon. Alright. Uh, 
second one. Okay, that's all I tell. Tell me which part of the city do you live in? Clever Hills or Fla Flowerville? Maybe? Tell me which part of the city do you live in? Calavera Hills? Calavera. Flowerville, maybe. Look, I I don't want to answer that. Ah, <sighs> shit. And not on personal business. Okay, we gotta focus on the shot. Let's try a different. Oh wait, that actually went in our favor. Yeah, plus ten. Uh, the second one. Remember, she's shy and doubtful. We can't attack her. <laughs> all right, all right, all right. Why did you have to visit me on this particular evening? Why did you Answer the question. <laughs> particular evening. I have my reasons. I may look like a silly little fawn. You are a silly little not, fawn. But I still have common sense. I hate. I don't doubt that I, for a God, second, Miss Ivanes. Everything about <laughs> this. This day is essential to my mistress, and she thought it's also in. So your Eve is essential to everybody, you a dumb fucking deer. For sure, but to be honest, the brain is size of a fucking cashew, you don't you? You know what? I'll just take that as a compliment, even if it wasn't meant to. Me, 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 me. Plus ten. Okay, we're doing good. Mm, shy, doubtful, frightened. Mm, okay, she's frightened. I'm thinking, why did you come to visit me? Why not your employer herself? Why did you come to visit yeah. me? Why not your employer? If she's frightened, she should be able to tell My us. Employer is Miss Natasha okay, now we know who the employer yes, is. Yes, That's important information. Lately. Write that down, Brandon. Write that down. Really <laughs> How so? Did it. She's a cat. <laughs> Miss Natasha is afraid. She's scared because of those unwanted uh -huh. messages. Uh -huh. and so she sends you out to is. deliver these so messages. I see. I see. She's that kind of woman. Of course you do. Oh, Deborah. she's that kind of woman. Thank you, by the way. <laughs> We're finally getting somewhere. <laughs> <laughs> no, bad deed. Deborah's hiding. This is an Enema. No question. Get yourself together. Let's focus on that. <laughs> she's hiding something. Okay. Shy, doubtful. Okay. What did you expect by coming here to meet me? How do you get this address? I'm mm. sure it's not intentional, but are you toying with me? Uh, no, no, no. Uh, what do you want from me? Uh, hmm. Yeah, let's do, let's do the first one. What exactly did you expect by coming here to meet me? What exactly did you expect by coming here to meet me? Mm -hmm. I expected your help. Just mm. That's hmm. very nice. But have you seen this neighborhood? Have you seen this wreck called a hotel? Who were you hoping to find in a place like this? Someone reliable. Well, I am reliable. And discreet. That's right. And thorough. No question about that. I don't know how she said thorough. How did she say it? Thorough. Oh. Okay. Heart of gold. Stop it right Listen. There. The Detective D here is alive. I got plus time for that. Okay. You think you can cut out for this kind of work? Let's pretend you've never Are you some sort of jam? Let's do that. Are you in some sort of jam? Are you in some sort of jam? Preferably jam. grape or cherry? Answer honestly. Uh uh. You gotta be honest. You gotta tell me everything. I can't help you if you don't tell me what the problem is. Then we can't help you. You think we're running a charity here, lady? I trust your instincts. You think all this this waifu figurines pay yeah. for themselves? And I have no other choice. You think right? this is a game? <laughs> no. Because it is! <laughs> Okay, got plus half for that. We were the point long enough. Deborah is hiding something. No questions. Let's focus on that. Okay. Where's the filth? Hmm. Hmm. She's hiding something. We gotta find out what she's hiding. What's let's the best? Let's, let's, let's attack. Let's do a little psychological attack. Have you okay. ever truly felt vulnerable? Have you ever truly felt vulnerable? Have you ever felt truly vulnerable? Honestly. Very often, mm -hmm. we're getting Mr. somewhere. Sutherland. Great, because that's exactly how I feel right now. We're not getting anywhere. <laughs> I'm sorry if it's too unpleasant for you. But we you still haven't told us what the fucking problem is. And it never ends well. Well, her 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 employer is getting weird, threatening letters. Okay, but she's not telling us something else. Like you need to tell us the full case, of the, the whole truth, not but the truth, so we can get on with this fucking case. Yes, exactly. That depends what you mean. Hold on. Now, before you hit the next button, that depends exactly what you mean. See, I prefer happy ending with a little angry handy J, you know what I'm saying? But, and, you know, storybook happy endings are good, too. 
Continue, Brandon. Books or movies, but in real life, it would be nice for a change. But this is what the fuck do you want me to do about it? Fuck. Do my clucking best over here. If what's between me and my whiskey could be called romance, then yes. Hmm. Okay, that was minus ten. Didn't kill. Okay. Damn. 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 Let's focus on the question. What's the point of all this? What's the point of all this? What's the point of all this, lady? Clean. You won't come clean. What's the point? I've had five different shots of whiskey. I'm sorry. I'm not afraid to I'm slap. Really too old for this game. Please, just think again. For me and my mistress. Nigga, four. God damn. Fuck. We went about that the wrong way. Deborah, why should I believe you at all? Because my mistress trusts you. That'll make a damn bit of difference. That be enough? I don't know this cat. If you really like what she thinks you are, then yes. Who does she think I am, yeah. Superman? What can I say to that? Look, that ain't how this I works, lady. You, you gotta pay us cohort de blooms. Sweetheart, did you ever want to be a cop? No, not for the... <laughs> Smart answer. Okay, we're still in the positive. We're still good, man. Be honest uh, and tell of? me what you're so afraid Listen, of. Listen, Brandon's a good cop. He's father. That you have bad cop and daddy you over know, here, all right? Mr. Featherland, my mistress's partner you can trust us. Mostly him. You can't Hobart trust Wessler. him. Hobart Wessler? Hobart Wessler? That guy is... Ooh, that guy rubs me to run. He was the gayest barber in town when I met him. Leave us tra trail pistachios wherever the fuck he went. Well, he's married to this cat lady. He's a respectable man, I agree. <laughs> <laughs> Full disclosure, I have no idea what the fuck's going on. <laughs> I don't either. Even Wessler. The Kingpin. Ooh. Oh, the Kingpin. 50 bucks says it's a pig. 50 bucks I hope says so. it's a pig. 50 bucks says <laughs> it's a pig. So. I hope so. No, it's a rat. Ah, oh, it's a rat. Oh, the Rat King. I get it. Yeah. Feathery gods, help me. Feathery gods, help so me. Get it now. The secrecy. Ah, okay. I think I understand it all. Mm. Wessler. This little piece of the puzzle changes everything. Damn it. We're a decent cop. Decent though. Questions asked 10. Focus accuracy 60%. Final thoughts that's how you do it. Partner, not quite like old times, but you've still got it. The old rooster still remembers some tricks, eh? And work with the employer and house's current significant other is a famous gangster. Okay. And Wessler. Now we could try that again, but we're not. Yes, okay. Sir. Let's see what we got. We got some clues here. Mysterious message of Miss Deborah even as his. I'm not saying her last name anymore. No. Employer <laughs> is a certain Miss Natasha Ka Katzenko. 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 The employer of Natasha's current if goes to the investigation of Eben Wessler. Chris! <laughs> so got seven on people, but like. Oh, well, you gotta flip backwards. It's different pages, see? There we go, that's what I wanted. We got Deborah. Uh huh. Uh huh. Nothing special, huh? Uh huh. Feel. Oh, she's a cat. Felis catus. She's female. Especially if she's remarkably green eyes. She's definitely in trouble. So, so am I. I. What y'all got? Y'all got some history? Allegedly, she's receiving serious threats. Mm hmm. Currently, the girlfriend of this notorious gangster Ivan Wessler. This explains a lot of things, mainly the excessive See? secrecy. See, this is why. This is why y'all girls, y'all, y'all. <laughs> Before we start reading, hang on. Let me get, spit some little life advice real quick. For, let me get the young ones in here. Y'all gather around. Gather around the phone, TV, whatever y'all watching this on. Ladies, I know dating a bad boy can be appealing, but take an example from Chicken Police. It always ends in this kind of shit. You're going to get a, a rooster detective coming to your house. Pick your love interest wisely. Brandon, you may continue. I'm done. She's afraid and she's secretive. Or she's just secretive. And an outstanding actress in any case. Not everything she told me is true. I'm pretty sure about that. Her employer currently bolstered the ranks of Ivan Wessler. To put it mildly, this explains a cold cloud of fear surrounding this Ivan Buddies. We gotta find a, a deer on the side of the road, aren't we? Probably. Ivan Wessler, species rat. Watch us. Good looking, charismatic, and a clucking gangster. A clucking gangster. Yeah, One of the most well known gangsters in Clawville. Real estate mongol. 
bank director, museum owner, distiller, smuggler, and information broker. And that's only not only the half of it. Half of what I've heard about him. Yes, his dirty little paws and neighbor in the city's underworld. Alright. But well, that's enough for this video, though. Are you sure? We're no. barely scratching the surface, and we we just got some clues. I know we did, but we're coming back with some more clues later. Yeah, fair enough. Anyway, everybody, remember to like, comment, subscribe, hit the little button in case you have all of our content. Remember to follow me on Twitter, Guide or D, and follow the Twitter channel of Obama Giving YT as well. I do post stuff about there. Brandon, any final thoughts before we get out of here? Uh, but you know what? You know what, buddy? This game has reignited something that I thought was gonna go away. What? Detective D's back, baby! I don't. Woo! You know when I turned this game on, I didn't. I I didn't really know what to expect. Did you get what you paid for? You know, for twelve bucks and a bundle of other games, yeah. Yeah, it's fine. I'm I'm, I'm somehow invested now to figure out where the fuck this is going. I'm. I'm invested, but I'm also terrified at the same time. <laughs> well, buddy, I just don't like the animal heads on human bodies. I don't know what about it makes me physically disturbed. Well, buddy, yo, if I see a, yo, bro, if I see a crocodile in this fucking game, there was one. There was one at the photos of the game where anything to go by. There, there is one somewhere. This might be the greatest game we've done on the channel so far. <laughs> This could be a great series. Is this gonna be you know, let's make it a series. I thought it would be a one and done thing. I feel like we could go far on this one. Let's see where the fuck it takes us, buddy Oh, But until then, ladies and gentlemen, we'll talk about care for the next one later. Bye, guys.